Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. On your screen, you will be seeing the oil record book part 1, which is for the machinery space operations, and it is the most sensitive document in the engine room alongside other documents. And next to that, you can see the content of the oil record book. But do you know that who actually writes in the oil record book? Most of us would be thinking that it is the responsibility of the chief engineer or the fellow engineers because many of people would have seen chief engineer writing in the oil record book. Some fellow seafarers would have seen the second engineer, third engineer or even fourth engineer writing in the oil record book. So there is a dilemma among the seafarers and during the MMD orals, the surveyor can ask who writes in the oil record book. So let's start with the discussion and clarify the doubt. As we know that the chief engineer is responsible for all the entries in the oil record book. We all know about this that he is countersigning after each entry. But it doesn't mean that the chief engineer is responsible to write in the oil record book. He is responsible for the entries which are made in the oil record book but he is not responsible for the writing an oil record book for every task. In the regulation of ORB given by IMO, it clearly states that the oil engineer should familiarize themselves with the guidelines and ensure the oil record book entries are made as per the guidance. We should focus on these words. All engineers should ensure the oil record book entries are made which clearly says that the all engineers means all the certified engineers on board should fill the oil record book according to the guidelines. Additionally, the chief engineer is not performing the task of every engineer because there are some transfers, there are some insulation, there are some evaporation, there is some oily water separator running. These all tasks are not performed by the chief engineer but are done by the fellow engineers. Hence, he should fill the oil record book himself. That means the certified engineer, let it be second engineer, third engineer or fourth engineer or chief engineer himself. The person who is performing the task should fill the ORB himself irrespective of only filling the chief engineer. A certified engineer performing the task or the watch engineer will sign the entries made into the ORB and chief engineer will countersign the entries. Additionally, master must check and sign each completed page. These things we are familiarized with and uh, please familiarize with the oil record book codes thoroughly. It is not only the responsibility of the chief engineer but of every certified engineer on board.